Your girl got pay. Your girl got pay. <laughs> Welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Destiny, but you call me Nene Bestie. Hey y'all. Back though, I am back and I have amazing news. Two things happened for your girl, thanks to y'all and the Lord, amen. Number one, your girl got paid. Your girl got paid. <laughs> your girl. Your girl got paid, y'all. My first YouTube check did come in, and that is what this video is gonna be about. The second thing was that I hit 2,000 subscribers. Yes, 2,000 besties. I love y'all so much. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for supporting. Thank you for like, commenting, etc., etc. But we're gonna go ahead and get to this video. I'm gonna let y'all know how much your girl made on her very first YouTube check, how to get paid how to get to this point and some tips on helping your channel out so that you can make that money. All right, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. I took notes for y'all cause this is serious. First thing we gonna get into is going to be the requirements. So the requirements to get into the YouTube partner program are you have to have 4,000 watch hours and a thousand subscribers. Now there's two, two levels to this. So the first level you gotta hit 500 subscribers and you gotta have 3,000 watch hours. And that's when you can create like um, these little groups or people can send you money through your page by clicking that little money icon at the bottom of your video. So like, that's like the first step is you can get paid from community. So if your subscribers want to send you money, they can, but you're not getting watch ads, which is how you're really getting your money from YouTube. That second level is you have 4,000 watch hours, 1,000 subscribers, but here's the catch. If you do YouTube shorts, you can do um, 1,000 subscribers and 10 million public short views. That's hard to get, but I mean, if that's what you want to do, that's what you want to do. People have succeeded. So, yeah. The important thing to know is that the 4,000 watch hours that you need to get into the partner program, they're not going to come from, those watch hours won't come from YouTube Shorts. You need to have them in long form content. So, um, the easiest way to track this is you need to get YouTube Studio. So, YouTube Studio, I know other people use a diff um, couple of different apps, but I didn't. I just use, used YouTube Studio, and um, when you click on that earn button, it'll have bars, and it'll let you know how, mu how much more do you need or how far are you in into your subscriber account, and it'll let you know how many watch hours that you have. And there, it's not always up to date, so sometimes after you post a video or something like that, you'll have to give it a couple of days to update, but you'll know. You know, I watch my my subscriber count and I watch my um my watch hours like a hawk. Like you will know, cause I was trying to get into that program. Those are the requirements. Once you meet the requirements, you need to apply into the YPP, the YouTube Partner Program. So basically, you'll just go into YouTube Studio, you'll press the Earn button, and you'll press Apply. Um, you can only apply once you um met the requirements so you'll know if you did or you don't because it won't let you apply if you did it but you'll apply and then you'll have to go through a verification which is a couple of few steps so step one you're gonna have to go read through the terms and agreement um the terms <laughs> read through the terms and conditions just like every other thing you have to read through the terms and conditions i did not nobody in their right mind is reading through the terms and conditions scroll down baby scroll all the way down press agree keep it pushing after that you're gonna need, while you're waiting for verification, you're going to need to create a Google AdSense account. You are not getting paid through YouTube, you're getting paid through Google AdSense, hence Google AdSense. So you'll have to make a Google AdSense account, um, set up all your information, do everything they ask you of, and you're gonna connect your YouTube channel to the Google AdSense account. You can only have one channel connected to it. Make sure you do this right, your channel, your email, your bank account information, everything needs to be connected to this Google AdSense because you're getting paid to watch ads. That's how you're getting your money. So you'll have to set that up. 
if you are younger, um, get an adult to do it because YouTube does not pay kids. Um, Google AdSense does not pay kids. You need to get an adult to do it. But if you are adult, um, I'm 22, so if you are adult, they're going to ask you for your bank information, your ID, driver's license, your social security number. They're going to ask you for your mailing address. Do not, do not lie. Do not give false information because you will not get your money. I, I, I promise you. You won't get your money. So what they gonna do is, I don't even really remember what was in this. Hold on, let me see. Okay, yeah. So what they gonna do is, after you put all that information in, they're gonna send you uh, your Google AdSense mail. This is how they verify your address, verify that this is you applying and everything like that, which is why you have to put an address in where you are either living at or where you're new. If you gotta send this to your grandma house, send it to grandma house, but make sure that you get it from grandma. You feel me? Okay, so once you get this and you open it up, try not to show y'all my address and my business, they're gonna ask you, paper's gonna look like this. And they're gonna give you your pin right here. And they're gonna tell you to sign into your assets account, go to payments, the verification check, and then you're gonna enter the pin they gave you and press submit. That's how your assets account is submitted. It's how it's verified and you want a route to get paid. Once you do that, that actually takes about, I wanna say they probably sent mine in the mail and probably like a week or two. This whole process can take up to like a month. So, um, patience, patience. Mine only took about a week or two, but hey. So, you do that and then your account is confirmed. Next, you have to go through, you have to do tax information. If you have done it before, you had a job before, you know your WOTC, you have to do it and you have to like, you know, I didn't do too much. Honestly, I'm only 22. I know I've been working since I was 16. So should I have a little idea about what this is? Yes. Have I always failed exempt? Yes. So I don't have no dependents. I really don't know what to put, which is bad. But at the end of the day, I really didn't put much. I just put, I didn't have no dependents. Scroll down, scroll down, signed it and minded my business. I'm gonna keep my receipts. I'm gonna keep everything. <laughs> everything I need to keep for the end of the year when taxes come around later but right now that's what I did so fill out your tax information if you are a child have your parents fill out your tax information all good okay so that's the end of the verification process when you're verified YouTube will send you a congratulations you have been verified everything is everything everything's copacetic you ready to get paid the next thing you need to do is choose how you want to make your money so you do have a few choices the first being watch page watch, oop, the first being watch page ads so i chose watch page y'all know i can't talk y'all know that i chose watch page ads because obviously that's how you're really gonna get that money okay like People need to be watching your video. You need them views. People need to be watching those ads. Hey, if an ad pop up on this, you better be watching this thing. Because I'm trying to help. I'm trying to help. And at the end of the day, why are you not watching my ads, girl, on a video where I'm telling you how to get the money? Just like you would want me to watch yours, watch mine. But watch page at Watch. <laughs> watch page ads i'm not saying it no more so you can either have watch page ads you can have shorts feeds ads and you can have supers so right now my watch page ads are on and my short feeds ads are on basically ads are going to play in your long form content so your videos that are 10 minutes long 15 minutes long 20 minutes long etc watch page ads are going to play in those and for the short feed ads also ads will play you know or pop up um if you post YouTube shorts. If your subscribers wanna give you money directly, they can through supers. So I have um, the first two turned on just so I can do ads. Um, I'm not really worried about supers. I don't really ask people for money directly, but if you wanna give it, by all means. <laughs> <The money. laughs> but no, so yeah, you pick how you want your money. You don't have to turn all of them on. You don't have to turn none of them on. They don't care. But. I suggest doing shorts and your long-term content um, ads for those. After that, you're prepared. You need to be consistent. I hate, I hate, I hate hearing consistency is key. Consistency is key. The truth is, it really is. And I want to talk. 
I ain't been consistent in a month because I've been gone. But I'm telling y'all the truth. It works. You need to keep posting. You need to keep posting. You need to keep posting. Um, monetization will be turned on. You can figure. You can choose which videos you want them to be turned on on. But if you turn them on all of them, you can get money from your old videos. But nine times out of ten. You're going to want to start getting videos out. Getting videos out. That way your view count can go up and you can get that money. Okay. So, you want to be consistent. Start posting videos. Start posting um, shorts. And, you know, just, just get it there. Watch your stats. Look at, you know, look at your analytics through the app. Through the um, YouTube Studio app. Um, look at what people like to see. Look at when are people pausing in your videos. Um, look at what what demographic, what age group, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Look at what the trending videos are on your YouTube homepage. Try to create ideas like that. You know, you at least want to throw in a trending or two video every now and then, such as like I do a target video. I know a target video is going to blow every time. So do what you want to do, but also keep in mind that you can also do fun stuff that is also like trending or whatever like that because people don't just want to watch you talk who are you until they find out who you are <laughs> but yes so now you want to get your videos going so here is the tea for me personally this was my process to getting paid so i hit my watch hours way before i hit my subscriber count which is because the first videos that I was doing on my channel were longer form videos and so even if people don't watch your video all the way through you got to think about it you got a 30 minute video a lot of people clicking on your watch hours is going up like this like this like this and so I was posting a lot of longer form content and so I hit my 4,000 watch hours way before I hit my thousand subscribers but this is how quick it went though once I hit a thousand subscribers, I hit, a, I don't know what day I hit my watch hours, but I know for sure I hit a thousand subscribers April 29th. April 29th, I hit a thousand subscribers. I was lit. I was lit. I said, baby, it's time to apply for that program. I did apply that same day. And, um, let me see. May 3rd, my assets account was verified and everything went through. And then May 6th was the day that I was officially um, invited to the YouTube Partner Program. Between hitting a thousand subscribers, applying, and um, getting everything squared away, it was about a week and a half. It took me about a week and a half. So they can say it takes up to a month, but nine times out of ten, they knock it out very very quickly everybody's not the same but i was good in almost two weeks like so it will go by quickly so everything was set up and squared away from me on may 6th i did not get paid officially until july 22nd and let me tell y'all why this is a big stipulation that I did not know that it is a very, very, very important for everyone to know. I had no idea. I was confused. I was wondering where my money at. <laughs> like, I was mad, y'all. I was mad. You have to watch your Google Assets account. You can also look on YouTube Studios. But you need to watch what your money says. And it's important to know. You will be getting paid on the 21st. You will be getting paid on the 21st of every month, right? If you meet the threshold. You have to meet the $100 threshold every single month. I thought you only had to hit it one time. Once you hit $100, it doesn't it matter if you made $5, you're just getting that $5. No, you got to hit it every single month. You have to make $100 to get paid from them. So, on the 21st, you get paid. From the 21st to the 15th of the next month, that's your pay period. That's when you're making your money. After the 15th, that's gonna go on the very next pay period, not this one. So, you have to be mindful of that. Um, so what I didn't understand was I didn't hit my threshold in time. I did not hit my threshold in time. And so it took two months for me to get paid because I wasn't I didn't hit my threshold on time for two months and so once I learned that okay I have to get my money by a certain time that's when I finally got paid so it did take two months 
and I thought it just restarted and they was like oh you earned this you earned this amount of money but you can't get it because you didn't meet your threshold and I was pissed oh I was mad I was mad but that's not how it works if you don't meet your threshold that money that you made it does add up and it carries on it carries on but you gotta hit that threshold so if you don't hit meet your threshold for three months and you made $20 this month $20 this month and maybe 60 70 the next month you that next month that's when you'll get paid off that money it added up but like it just took forever to get so that's why you want to be consistent you want to be putting your videos out because if you do not meet your threshold you will not be meeting no money you won't be your bank account no money from youtube assets from me from google assets you will not be getting no money so keep that in mind be consistent post 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 i did not get paid in august i should have been getting paid today yesterday yesterday was august 21st should have been getting paid yesterday but i didn't meet my threshold i didn't post any video and so right now if i go on here right now i've only made i don't know if y'all can see it right now i've only made 68 dollars this month and that's over with like <laughs> it's over with that was between last month and this month i only made i got paid last month so between then and now, I only made $68. I didn't make 100 So I would not be getting paid, but I did not meet my threshold because I had not been posting any videos. However, I haven't posted in a month, and the reason why I made that money is because you're getting paid based off your views. Google AdSense pays you based off your views. So as long as your videos are getting views, you're still getting paid. So I have not posted in a month, but yet I've made $68 because my videos are still getting views. So don't delete no videos. I have two recent videos. My two recent videos did not get no views for real. They flopped. Oh well, do not delete no videos. They're still getting views. Even if you get one cent, that one cent will add up and you will, and it will, you know, come together. So don't just, don't get discouraged, especially as a small creator. You will not <laughs> always meet your threshold and amen when you do. And we hope that, you know, the hope is that you're consistent and your, and your channel continues to grow. And, you know, eventually you never got to worry about hitting that threshold because that's a given. So keep going. Now let's get into some tips. Before I tell y'all how much I made, let's get into some tips, y'all. Some tips on how to make it to said point. Everybody is not gonna tell you this, but I'm gonna tell you this because the truth is you can do what you want to do on your channel. Love it. You should. It's your channel. You know, you should be proud of what you're posting, um, passionate about the videos you're making and the content that you're putting out. However, however, when you first make your channel and you're trying to get there, until people start subscribing to you and start watching your videos and knowing you more there has to be a reason for them to click you have to put in work you have to do the editing you have to do the thumbnails i struggle bad with thumbnails and some a lot of my videos do perform poorly because of that even though there's good content you have to focus you have to focus even if it feels like oh i'm not you know i haven't made it to the partner program it feels like it's taking forever Oh, well, so what? The time will still pass. What are you going to do about it? You going to make your videos or not? <laughs> Ew, that was crazy. You going to make your videos or not? So, um, I first made my YouTube channel. I first posted 11 months ago. I did not become consistent until three months ago when I had only about 500 subscribers. Now, while this video, while I'm making this video, I have, within a three months time frame, I have 2029. So I didn't came out of, like, I didn't came up about 1500 subscribers in three months. Um, I also got accepted to the partner pay program and I also got paid my first check. Consistency is key. Consistency matters. It took me, <laughs> it took me 11 months to get here because three months ago i finally realized i need to be consistent to make it to this point make your videos keep going keep figuring it out watch your analytics pay attention let this to be like for me this is a passion when i'm in it i'm in it i love it i love editing i love recording sometimes i cannot always find the energy and the strength to get up and do this but when i do it i love it so 
do it because you love it make it a passion don't just do it for the money because i'm telling you <laughs> i've invested a lot into this and have not seen that much return but i know that if i become consistent i will so keep that in mind don't just give up it does take a while but it will be worth it and it doesn't take a while from everybody you might have something special and you might be god and youtube's favorite and your channel might go from her to her overnight but keep going don't be a scared to do a trendy video like i do trendy videos all the time that's how i got most of my subscribers and most of my views i was recording myself moving into my apartment people love a good movie and vlog i was recording myself going to target people love a good target vlog it never fails however these are things that i was doing anyway i go to target periodically i love target that's where i get all of my feminine hygiene care stuff so of course i'm gonna do a video I was moving in my apartment. I had to move in. I had to decorate. I had to do all these things. Of course, I was going to record that. My other videos, they struggle a little more, but I'm still figuring out niche. So it's okay to struggle. Even once you're in the program, struggle is real. <laughs> you know, one day somebody might want to watch. The next day they won't. Um, you know, someday you might have a thousand subscribers and the next day you might have 999 somebody unsubscribe. Keep going. It is going to be perfectly fine. Like, it's cool. But yes i just want to give that advice that little spiel because it did take a while but i'm very happy about where i am right now i have so many tips if y'all want to know the real um on creating a youtube channel creating your banner your background your intro what camera equipment everything that you need to that you should use um do you need a camera like so many advice etc 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 if y'all do want to hear that advice drop a comment below let me know and i will make that video follow me on my instagram and dm me a couple y'all have been dming me Mwah. love y'all to smithereens i love 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 talking to my besties and some of y'all do dm me and i do reply back if you watching this reply in the comments and let them know i do reply back and we do talk sometimes it might take a day or two because i don't know instagram got this little update where some people in the primary and some people in the general I never click on general and then when i do i'm like oh my subscribers in here hey girl <laughs> but follow me on my instagram i do follow back i do reply to dms let me know what you think let me know more of what you want to see and let me know if you need any help i always am willing to help me helping your channel out does nothing to my channel it does not diminish my diminish my channel it does it does not make me make less money it does nothing to me i am very willing and always ready to help so follow my instagram follow my snapchat i'm always posting on there um and my tiktok i'm always on there too so um without further ado this is how much your girl made why did i grab this paper i didn't <laughs> i don't know why i grabbed this like first of all some people do get paper checks you can um you can decide that like if you don't want to put your bank account information in they can sit like send you a paper check in the mail but i don't have that i did direct deposit so let me look my first youtube paycheck on the picture is gonna say the 22nd but i got paid on the 21st i just screenshotted this on the 22nd but on july 21st i got paid 125 dollars and 51 cents <laughs> y'all listen i was so happy to get that money unfortunately y'all know me i spent it immediately do i know what i spent it on absolutely not probably food or something but y'all it's not extra surprise me i only cared to get a hundred dollars i don't care if it was a hundred dollars and five cents i have seen other videos where they only made like 105 106 107 so i would gracefully and gladly take my 125 dollars and go if you know what i'm saying because at the end of the day you're recording a video, literally talking to yourself, dang near being delusional <laughs> until your supporters watch it. You know, it connects and it's like community, but essentially you kind of doing delusional behaviors and you get to pay for it. So, um, I'll take my 125. I love to hear. I cannot wait to keep posting to keep growing, but that is how much I get paid. Um, eventually in the future, I am willing to do another video kind of updating, updating y'all um once my, sub my subscriber count grows more my views grow more um and everything like that like once i start getting that money in because i'm claiming it and i know it's gonna happen i will make another video letting y'all know what that's looking like but 
that's not much I got paid <laughs> as a small content creator, a small YouTuber um, for my first paycheck. And yeah, um, I did spend it like I said, but the next video that I'm going to do that's going to be coming out is I'm going to take y'all with me on a day spending my first YouTube check. Keep in mind, I did already spend it, but I know how much it was. So, I don't know what I spent it on, probably some food, but we gonna go out and see what can $125 get me. And I'm hoping it can get my nails and toes done, me something to eat in the movies or something. So, <laughs> we gonna see what I can do with this little 125, but big 125. But yeah, so that's gonna be the next video. I do have a lot of video ideas coming up for y'all. Um, I have a lot of life updates. Like I said, I did re-enroll in school. Um, so I'll be taking y'all back to school shopping with me, everything. And so I'm gonna have videos coming like this, like this. I'm trying to make it up to y'all for being gone for a month. Um, still in the process of losing weight, so don't be talking about my big back and my heavy breathing. At the end of the day, I'm figuring it out. But yeah, so that is all for this video. Hope y'all like my hair. This is a glueless wig. <laughs> Get one of those. Let me know if y'all want me to make some more wig content because I put on wigs every two seconds. I do lay them myself. They do look good. And yeah, I love doing wig content. But anyway, that is the end of this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to follow my social medias down below, baby. I'm talking about Snapchat, Instagram, TikTok. Follow all of it. I don't care. DM me. Drop a comment. I do take constructive criticism. If you do not have any for me, tell me what you liked about the video or shoot. If you ain't like nothing about the video, just say, hey, girl, say something nice. <laughs> Drop a comment. Send this to your mama, sister, daddy, uncle, grandma, auntie, cousin, daddy, and all of them. Yeah, and tell them to watch this video because, yeah, I say so. So, yeah, I love you. God loves you. He has amazing, amazing plans for your life. Bye, bestie. See you in the next one.